Whether you navigate to users using the search options, or through the, the directory and then org units or users, when you click a user, of course, you have the pop-out menu. And within there, we can take a number of administrative actions. Update password updates their CloudM and or Google password. We can clear their password recovery and manage their two-step and backup codes. There's also the ability to configure email settings. These are things you cannot do in the Google Admin Console as an admin. These tasks simply don't exist. So that's send as, you can set up forwarding, or even the out of office, or in here it's called the, the vacation responder. We can view their email signature, so that's a preview of the signature that's being generated for them. Set their calendar time zone, rename them, that could be their name or email address, move them to a different OU, place them on hold. This means if they were to be offboarded, that offboarding wouldn't run. So if they're under legal hold, it prevents it protects them from losing any data. We could offboard the user, that would trigger the offboarding policy. We could set an end date, that's the date the offboarding policy would run. Or we could suspend or hide the user. Hiding them would hide them from the Google directory. You can also configure roles to choose what permissions within CloudM they have. Look at what applications have connected to their account and revoke access. Delegate access to their Gmail account. This would give whoever you specify here access in their own Google account to this person. You can also do the same for calendars. And then lastly, we can inspect configuration. And that would show us what each configuration item, or at least where each configuration item is inherited from. In this case, it's just OUs, but that could also be smart teams. As well, there is an edit menu, and in here you can change different profile fields would then be synced into Google and updated. Let me cancel that. I'd also like to mention as well that if you were to update a profile field in Google, that would sync back to CloudM every 48 hours. 